everybody, it's NCP. It's another one of those rainy day videos because every day that I try to work on the truck in North Carolina when it's a free time, it rains. Maybe tomorrow we can <clears throat> my apartment won't look like a garage anymore with tools everywhere. And we can go ahead and get this thing completed. <clears throat> but that's not what this video is about. This video is about keeping preps in a vehicle. Every um season I change what I have in my vehicle because it's what I eat. And I don't leave things in too long, but now I keep spam usually different different types throughout the year and I swap it out and whatever, but I keep spam in there because it's it's good and it's you know it's you know it's sealed up and it's good. But the point is I had some spam that went bad. Now if you look at this one, it's very, very swollen. And if I shake it you should be able to hear that. Usually they're kind of vacuum packed. Now I got a uh, a ruler to show you. It should be flat like that at the base, but up here you can see it's not. It's very, very warped and full. Now I pulled the cover off this one, and uh, I can barely push it in. See that? It's all swollen. There's there's a bunch of these cans. So, I was wondering, these ones here are all bad, the turkey one, and they're all pressurized, and they're all loose in there. Some were good, but these aren't. should probably open this one and see what's in it, huh? Let's break it open, shall we? I hope goo doesn't get on me. Oh, God, it smells like cat food. Absolutely horrible. It's not really wanting to open here. Hold on. Mm, God, it's stuck. Oh, well, it looks okay. Except for the black mold on the top. God, I can't get this thing open. Sorry, guys. No, well, it's fine. If you look here, I can see some black stuff up here. Some mold. See that? Not a lot, just a little bit. But, you know, I'm not going to eat this. I really don't have anywhere to pour this out. I'd show you guys better, but the side's got mold on it in there. All right, there we go. I don't know if you can see that. Sometimes it just goes bad. But, I don't know. Anyway. It's got a very bad texture to it, too. It's like hard, like like wax. Gross. It stinks really bad. So, check your preps. But what do you guys recommend for, for hiking and keeping in the truck? Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? I want it in there. I leave it time. Usually I just store what I eat and stuff. But... I never, I've never had spam go bad, and not, you know, like 10 cans between the two vehicles, but 10 cans went bad, and they're all swollen and bulging, so, you know, it says it's good with just add spam, well, I'm thinking here we're going to just add botulism, so, I don't know, I'm going to throw these out safe so no animals get it or anything, but, I don't know guys, tell me what you think, um, what do you guys carry in your vehicles? Like I said, this, will, this won't necessarily be for emergency preps. This will be stuff I want to go keep in there in case like, oh, I'm going to go camping this weekend, just go. I'm going to keep the truck pretty much loaded like a bug out vehicle, but just for camping. And like I said, well, I'm going to do a whole bunch of videos on that later on. But what, what do you guys think? Um, let me know what you think. All right, have a great day, everybody. Let me out.